I must say, I'm quite impressed with how this party turned out. You're not gonna bribe me to leave with ice cream again, are you? How long did that ice cream even last? Like two days. I made sure everyone got a serving, then Kun Lao ate the rest. By the gods, he's got a worse appetite than me. And that's really saying something. Do you really have to play bartender? Why don't you take a break for one party? I'm not playing anything, Mother. This is my passion. You're really good at it. You should open your own bar. That's actually not a bad idea, Jax. I'm just saying, you're royalty. You shouldn't be serving people drinks like a peasant. Fine. I'll stay for the Easter party, but then you owe me a two-week vacation. Consider it done, my friend. Pretty ballsy of you to crash his holiday like that. By the Elder Gods, it was an emergency! And when I say two weeks, I mean two weeks uninterrupted. I don't care if fucking Armageddon happens. Deal with it. I don't want you hanging out with Cage anymore. He's a bad influence. Shh. Since when did you become so bossy? Perhaps we should start with a clean slate? No! Who do you think you are? Telling me who I can and can't hang out with. You're the only family I've got left. And if something happens to you... Can I get you something to drink, Jonathan? Uh, thanks, but I'm not a huge fan of alcohol. Uh, don't be such a snowflake. One drink ain't gonna kill you. Uh, I said no, Kano. I'll take one fantasy. Are you even old enough to drink? I'm a man where it counts. <laughs> Quan Chi, I worry that our new employees are slacking on the job. Then it is up to you to discipline them, Bihan. How about you? Would you like to purchase some Discord Nitro? Oh, I would, but I have an actual social life. Why do you have to do this right now? Be silent, woman. I apologize if this isn't up to the dress code. When you said Easter colors, this was the best I could find. You look beautiful, Lee Mei. Surely you know that's not your Lee Mei, Master. Uh, I know, but I just see so much of her in this one. Ooh, looks like someone has a crush on not you. Not the appropriate time, Sonya. Well, here I am, and I brought the lemons you wanted. Oh, thank you, Nolan. You're the best. Are you sure making your limoncello mojito is a good idea? Yes, it's my most popular cocktail. Oh, yeah, that was a great party. I don't like how much faith you're putting into that new... I commanded him to obey, Shang Tsung. Worry not. <laughs> Noob! Sonya, go kill someone else's brain cells. What you're doing is just wrong. Of course it is. That's why we're doing it. Oh, uh, what the hell happened to the music? God damn it, Kun Lao. You played the wrong London Bridge! What do you mean? I played what I was told You're to play! You're such a fucking idiot! Ugh, give me that! What the hell is happening? The Bachelor Bros are in the house! Ah, uh, I see Cage has arrived with his posse. Oh, absolutely not! This is not happening! <laughs> Who the hell do you think you are? This is my party! Change the music back! Sorry, John Crate, but around here, I'm the party planner. Look at how much fun everybody's having. You don't want to rob them of that, do you? That's bad party planning, bro. I've planned every detail of this party, and I will not let you ruin it. <laughs> yeah. I'm in the mood to get fucked up. Give me your strongest drink. One dirty Adinian coming up. These names are so stupid, but so creative. I'm gonna take that as a compliment. You know what else is coming up? Police brutality! Fuck yeah! Your counterpart from this timeline is staring at me. Hmm. Perhaps it has something to do with your outfit. <sighs> it's super hot, in a, a holy kind of way. Don't mind him, he's just horny. The last thing I want to do is invoke the lust of a man. You seem a bit tense. Could I interest you in a phantom? Thanks, but I'm the designated driver. Yeah! Does anybody else see a problem with this? I can see without using my eyes, Satoshi. Ah, come on, mate. One drink will be fine. It should be out of your system by the end of the party. <laughs> I got it. We'll call ourselves the Silver Universe Clemency Knights. You want to call us the Suck? How about the Silver League of Unstoppable Talent? Oh, great. We'll be the slut. Well, you come up with one. Why don't you think of something simple like the Chrome Combatants? What are we, fucking Google? <laughs> yeah. 
Well, hello there. And what's your name? Hey, 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 hey. I'm Liu Kang. Kun Lao. I've got a weird feeling in my chest. You've got a crush on her, dude. So handsome and so adorably stupid. You're called Himbos, Nitar. Any progress with Cyrax gear is? Very minimal, but it's still progress. Cyrax, what day is today? Okay, I've got some more work to do. At least you've got him speaking sentences the now. What kind of sentence was that? So is it true that you girls really do that scissoring thing? Are you suggesting that I cut Tanya? <laughs> For that, I will scissor your brains out! Melina, that's not what that means. <laughs> Can I get in on this? Up for a tag team? No! You know, I have a strange craving for chicken nuggets. We haven't talked in like three months, and that's what you have to say? He stoned out of his mind. It's one of those parties. Those edibles weren't shit. I'm complaining to the weed oh, And some McCurth Realm Burger Donalds! Okay, girl talk. Have you and Thomas did do it yet? I think you've had a little too much to drink, Katana. No, yeah, you didn't answer the question. Would you even remember the answer? <laughs> no. You didn't happen to eat the brownies, did you? They were so good! I couldn't eat just one. <laughs> Was that really the best choice of attire for this party? Girl, I have six outfits, and none of them include a shirt. I do not see anyone else complaining. It does give me the motivation to keep in shape. I wish I could wear a shirt. Goro, why do you always say the most random things? You, Behan, finally got the N-word pass, I see. Your sense of humor is still unamusing, Cage. I'll pay him no mind, sweetie. Leave me alone, demon. You know, these kinds of jokes really grind my gears. Grind your gears? <laughs> you are so goddamn immature. You bite me. What do you say the two of us sneak off to the palace to have some fun? What, now? Uh, princess, is that really appropriate? Yeah! Don't you dare blow this, right? I, I well, but, uh, but uh, now? Sonia, I need you to keep the Scream Queen occupied. Yes! Count on me, girl! <laughs> Stop moving the silverware! It's supposed to be perfectly perpendicular to the plates! Oh my god! Eat a few brownies and shut up! Where'd you even get these, dogs? A couple guys from another timeline sold them to me. Blah! These taste weird. I find that the more you eat, the better they taste. Mm, I guess I'll take your word for it. <laughs> yeah. Wait! You were here the whole time? Yes, but I was spending most of it trying to repair Cyrax. Cyrax, can you tell me the date? I have found several recipes that contain dates. That's not what I fucking asked you! When I get my hands on Lu Kang, I swear- Something's wrong. The world is spinning. The world is always spinning. Spinny, spinny, spinny! <laughs> The word you just described is rotation. Spinny, 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 spinny. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. Something's definitely wrong with those brownies. I don't like this. I don't like this. I am really displeased with your progress. If you don't start acting diligently, serious consequences will occur. We be working so hard, Mr. Boss. Okay, what the fuck is that hair though? Shut up or be die. You tell him, babe. But why am I strangely attracted to you? Yo, that helmet's pretty stylish, my man. I can say the same to you, kind sir. Why don't you two just make out already? Hey, we're not, uh, male lesbians. I am detecting high amounts of sexual tension. No, you're wrong. That was my attempt at humor. Ha ha ha. Something's wrong, Li Mei. I feel weird. It must be the brownies. Oh, they're too brownie-y. Dude, I think they were laced with something. The brownies were laced with browniness. By the way, Katana and Raiden are definitely not doing it right now. Thank you, Sonya. That's good to know. Why the fuck did you need to interrupt my vacation? 
when there was a whole nother gear is here. Oh, wait, there was? <laughs> I had no idea. Isn't it your responsibility as the Keeper of Time? What is a responsibility? By the gods! <gasps> Why can't you act more like your Alpha Timeline counterpart? You know what's a funny word? Worcestershire sauce. No, man, it's pronounced like Worcestershire sauce. Uh, no, it's Worcestershire sauce. Correct pronunciation is Worcestershire sauce. I hope you're happy. Your noob is having the noob sex with Sarina! That is not possible, Tsang Shung. I did not bestow upon the noob the art of bitch fucking! Oh! I have a ton of experience in that heart! Unfortunately, none of it is real world experience. Bro, what you mean? Is this what men have come to? No men are coming to you, Shuya. Oh, fuck you, you lousy son of a bitch! You shouldn't have eaten those brownies. They had weed in them. What? How am I supposed to operate a motor vehicle with weed in the brownies? That's the neat part. You don't. Those brownies are evil. Evil brownies. So how many did you eat? Only one. They weren't that good. You son of a bitch. You stole my girl. I didn't steal her. She came on me, came on to me. Oh. <laughs> she came on you? Man, I wish. Uh, yeah, she really rocked his world. You bitch. Her bitch. Everyone bitch. You need to get more brownies, my male. I finished the rest of the plate. You ate that whole plate? Damn, dude. You must be feeling good. You know they had pot in them, right? Pot. They had pot. They were pot brownies. Pot brownies? Like pancakes? Oh, I could go for some pancakes. John, enjoying the party, my friend? Uh, I, I don't know. The world is revolving around me. I feel so dizzy. Oh, God, I feel nauseous. What's happening? I'm freaking out. Well, have fun with that. I think I'm going to take a little nap. You know, that's not a bad idea. Lord Liu Kang! Ah. Good morning. Uh, I feel like shit. You're hungover. You know, you really overdid it last night. I suppose. Well, guess it's time for the cleanup. How many casualties were there? None. Everyone just kind of passed out. Yup, and it's all thanks to me. Excuse me? My boy Kurt told me about the Christmas party. I brought some edibles so everyone would be too high to kill each other. How? Uh, why does that make sense? They don't call me Peacemaker for nothing. Oh, by the way, you kind of barfed all over that queen girl's sofa. She hasn't realized yet, but it's only a matter of time before... <laughs> Never mind. She realized. I see you're finally awake. Geiris. I take it you're off to your vacation now? Not quite. I have one more thing I want to do. All right, Jonathan. I'm not going to be around to fix time for a while, so that responsibility goes to you. And I'm gonna teach you how to do it. Sounds good, boss. But wait, no one's dead. We don't need to rewind time right now. Hmm, yeah, that's a good point. Um, was that necessary? No, but he really pissed me off. Plus, you've got a perfect person to practice on. Now let's get started.